how many fishes per tank this is the most frequently asked questions for any beginners in wire flock setup so let's discuss on this topic today before deciding on the fish density in your bioflock tank, first identify what biomass or marketable fish size or weight you are looking per fish. For example, it could be 200 grams, 400 grams or 600 grams etc. to be sold in your local market or accepted in your domestic market. Always remember, bioflock is meant for a short harvest culture of six to seven months time only therefore you can't expect the fish the biomass beyond 500 to 600 grams in six to seven months culture neither you should expect the bioflock system will give you one kg of biomass or a marketable size fish in six to seven months now identify which species are suitable for culture in six to seven months that can give you 500 to 600 grams of biomass and which is easily sellable in your local market or within your nearby area if new to bioflock system never try fish species which is not sellable in your local market go for only those species which can be easily sold in your nearby wholesale market or local market most people breed desi mango singi Vietnam koi, tilapia, pangashes, shrimps, etc. in bioflux system as this species can achieve the required or acceptable biomass in 6 to 8 months and which is easily sellable in their domestic or local market. Note, longer the harvest period, it might be not be profitable as it will increase your FCR, that's a food con conversion ratio. Assuming that you have finalized the fish species, let's calculate how many fishes can be cultured in 10,000 liter tank. First density for tank has been classified as below. And fish, one fish or a one biomass or fish biomass per 9 liter. That means one fish per 9 liter is considered to be a high density. And it's basically for the expert level people who are who can control high density with very ease with their expertise and second is like one fish per 15 liters which is considered to be a medium density uh, which is like for the mid level level people uh, aquaculturist or a farmer when and it will be a one fish for per 25 liters it's to be considered to be a very comfortable density it can be done for the starter levels who are just a beginner in bioflock system so now let's calculate the medium density with 1 kg biomass one refer to one fish or fish biomass or bio or a marketable size so per liter one fish per liter 9 liter of water so 1 kg biomass into 15 liters equals to 15 10,000 liter water tank divided upon 15 equals to 666 fishes approx in a 10,000 liter tank we can expect an harvest of 550 kgs considering of 20% mortality Let's now calculate the medium density with 500 grams of biomass. 500 grams or 0.500 kgs of biomass into 15 liters equals to 7.5. 10,000 liter tank divided upon 7.5 equals to 1,333 fishes approx in a 10,000 liter tank. So here also considering 20% of mortality, we can expect an harvest of 550 kgs. Let's now calculate the medium density in the 250 grams of biomass. So 0.250 kgs biomass in the 15 liters equals to 3.75. 
So 10,000 liter tank divided upon 3.75 equals to 2,666 fishes approx in a 10,000 liter tank. So expected harvest considering mortality is 550 kgs. Similarly, you can calculate for high density and comfortable density based on the water tank capacity as per your need and the species to be cultured. Note, new beginners can start with the medium or a comfortable density to lower the chances of mortality. High density has the higher chances of high mortality if unable to control all the parameters of biofluxus system.